Good morning, guys. Jelly beans are fun here from Streamer House. I'm gonna show you where the Zer lo is located in 42. Go down the middle as soon as you spawn into town. Low here. Down to the Vanguard guys. Take a look at what he's got for us. Got the Peregrine Green. These are the new boots for Titan. Uh, allows you to carry more ammo for heavy weapons. Been activated in the air. Super freaking awesome if you and you like to glide the air with the Titan and shoulder charge. Because it's pretty fun and hilarious. Uh, Crest of the Alpha Lupine. This chest piece right here is a must have if you were PvPing, if you're doing Trials of Osiris. This is a must-have chest piece. Um, it allows you to revive teammates faster, and then you get revived faster as well. And this one's actually got a really good roll that gives you allow you to carry more special ammo and hand cannon. Uh, hand cannons and shotguns or snipers are top three choices right now for a gun. Very rarely will you use anything other than a hand cannon or a shotgun. If you're using something like a like a, a long-ranged like a pulse rifle or assault rifle, um, you're not really going to have as good a time as if you were using last word a thorn. That's awesome. That's a really good chest piece. Um, this is part of the Praxis Praxic Fire? Yeah, sorry. Fumbling over words. Morning time. Further, further decreases all ability cooldowns with Radiance is active. While Radiance is active. So this would be a Sunsinger chest piece. Um, I personally don't sun sing very often, um, but I can see where this could be very useful. I'm not too sure, but I'm I'm mainly void walker and I mainly play the warlock, so not too sure. There were a lot of debates about which gun would be this week, and the first gun that came out of my head was Red Death. Um, with all of the previous guns and what what's been out here. Um, they haven't done a pulse rifle yet, and it's gonna be Red Death. I know it's gonna be Red Death. And look, looky here. I was right. I'm a winner. I did it. <laughs> this gun right here is freaking awesome. Um, it's got really good uh, fire rate. Um, it's got a really awesome perk on it, the Red Death perk, which each kill heals you and speed loads. So if you get a lot of kills, you're just going to have your health regen like crazy, and you're going to have crazy awesome reloads. Very difficult to not get a headshot with this gun. It is it is an awesome gun. If you have the strange coins to get it, I highly recommend that you get this. It's good for PvP. It's good for... Um, I haven't used it in PvE, but I could see where it could be pretty good in PvE if you're fighting a lot of stuff that needs to kill you. So... That would be something I recommend. Um, but yeah, and then also helming. Not too bad. But that is all, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.